Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Rishi Labs. In today's video, we will see how to download and install Zen browser. So let's get started. For this, I'll make use of Google Chrome. In the address bar, you need to type Zen space browser download and press enter. You'll get the first link Zen browser. Click on it. So it's a new web browser. It's still in the alpha version. So stay focused, browse faster with Zen. So Zen browser is specialized browser developed with a focus on privacy, speed and add free browsing. So over here, you need to click on download Zen now. Zen browser is available for Windows and Linux as well as Mac OS. We'll select for the Windows and click on continue. It is going to give you two options, optimize and generic. We'll click on optimize and click on continue. Over here, select installer and click on download. So it will start the download of the setup. Once it is downloaded, click on open. This software is still in the alpha phase. You'll get a pop up, select yes. I'll just minimize this. Okay. So welcome to Zen browser setup wizard. Over here, you need to click next. Click on standard. Zen browser will be installed with the most common options. Click on next. It will be installed on the this default installation path. Click on install. Within very less time, it got installed. Okay, I'll just uncheck this. Click on finish. Now to open Zen browser, you will get a desktop icon. You can double click this icon and open. Otherwise, you can click on the Windows key over here in search. You can type Zen. Okay, you will get the app icon to open. So I'll open the Zen browser by double clicking this icon. It has a dark interface. Welcome to Zen browser. Fast, beautiful and private. Click on next. So make yourself at home. You can personalize your experience. Okay, by choosing the color theme. I'll go with this blue. And select the light mode click on next so you can bring your favorites to zen browser you can import your data from another web browser suppose i am using google chrome so i can import browsing data from there i'll click on cancel if you want to import you can select the web browser from here okay you can see microsoft internet explorer option is also there microsoft edge is also there okay so you can import data from your previous web browser by clicking on this import, I'll click on cancel and click on next. Okay, choose a search engine, it gives you an option. You can set Wikipedia, Google, or DuckDuckGo. I'll select Google, click on next. Thank you so much. Okay, click on next. This is the home page for Zen browser. You can see over here the highlighted message Zen browser is still in development and may have works. Okay, so this welcome page is under construction. So they are working on the welcome page. Now getting started, you can see over here under this tab. So Zen browser is a Firefox based browser with a focus on privacy and customization. So it is not a Chromium based browser. It is a Firefox based browser. Then over here you get the download option. Then Zen mods. Customize your browser with a variety of mods. Okay, they also provides. I'll click on this. And you can see the release notes. Stay up to date with the latest changes. You can track the versions of this software and the changes being implemented. Over here in Zen Mods, let's see. In Zen Mods, you can search for the different mods. You can see allow toolbar theming, lots of themes, customization options are there. Now over here you get a reload page, forward button, backward button. Okay. Now this over here it's the open settings. And in this settings, you can see a lot of features are there for general. Open previous windows and tabs. Open Zen browser automatically when your computer starts up. If you want to do that, you can just check this. Zen browser is not your default browser. That's why they're showing smiley. You can make change to it. Then you can also import browser data from the another web browser. 
like you can import bookmarks, passwords, history, and autofill data into the same browser by using this import data option. Then in the tabs, you get a lot of features, customization like control plus tab, cycles through the tabs in the descent order use. You can check and uncheck these options to view. Then if you want a confirmation before closing multiple tabs, you can just check this. So it will give you a pop-up. That do you really want to close those tabs? Okay. Then enable container tabs in settings. You can see a lot of personal work, banking, shopping, container tabs are there. You can add more containers to it. I'll go back. In language and appearance, you can change the way it looks. Okay. I have selected light. If you want to change, you can change it to dark mode. Okay. I'll select automatic. Over here, there is an option manage Zen browser themes. You can also set themes for your web browser. Next is the colors. Over at Zen browser's default colors for text, website, backgrounds, and links. Okay. There are a lot of customization. You can change the website, page background. Okay. And then zoom if you want web page to be zoomed okay you can select zoom level up to 500 percent is available you can also zoom text next is the language if you want to set any different language for your web browser you can do that you can also download the translations for the web pages and files and applications save whatever softwares or anything which you download on the internet it will be saved to this directory downloads folder you can change the default path and zen browser updates over here you can check show update history and you can also check for updates here there is an option automatically install updates whenever new update is there if you open the zen browser it will be downloaded You can also choose an option if you want to check for updates but let you know if you want to install it or not so there is a configuration available to allow zen browser update then performance settings are there then browsing auto scroll there are a lot of features the network settings configure how zen browser connects to the internet even you can change those in settings so those are all the general features in look and feel if you click on this tab you can see theme options are there and theme settings now how the look of the zen browser should be you can select that the split view it enables okay you can have a side web panel then split view two you can access two web pages at the same time okay in site bar and tabs layout in tab management you can do a lot of feature check of the tab management then keyboard shortcuts you can set keyboard shortcuts in this panel if you want to quit an application you can see the keyboard shortcuts for it then zen mods okay in zen mods you can find and install themes from the store again a lot of themes are available in zen mods so in home tab you can set the home page and the new windows so firefox home default is there if you want a certain url to be your home page you can set it over here select custom url and you can provide google link over there so whenever you open a web browser it will show you the google search page and in next over here is a search which search engine you want so we have selected Google by default. We'll scroll down. Then privacy and security settings. It provides enhanced tracking protection. Trackers follow you around online to collect information about your browsing habits and interests. Okay. So Zen browser, what it does by default, it blocks many of these trackers and other malicious scripts. So it is this browser completely focuses on your privacy. And it provides you high speed internet browsing experience. Over here, you can delete cookies and site data. 
clear data manage data options are there which we most probably use if you want to clear history on this panel inside privacy and security you can clear the history and also you can get the passwords cookies and side data okay there's a clear data options is there and permissions you can also manage the permissions all these permissions are listed so this browser provides a complete transparency what i can see in the settings in sync so take your web with you you can sync it to sync you will need to sign in okay and you can sign in with your firefox account then the next is firefox labs these are experimental features developer tools is there ai chatbot picture in picture auto open on tab okay so a lot of features are there for example if you want ai chatbot to be enabled i'll check this choose one i'll select chat gpt okay so ai chatbot is there you can see easy access to it i'll close this next is extension and themes over here you can see all the extensions for this web browser next is themes and last is the plugins to select back on the settings tab so we have covered extension and themes then zen browser support if you click on this please take you to the website mozilla website it is going to forward you to firefox options preferences and settings so this zen browser is built on the firefox so let's go back to the page from where we have downloaded and let's see the features of it and click on the zen stay focused browser faster with zen alpha version it is over here you can see how much browser do you want you can change the layouts okay as per your need then customizable down to the last pixel they are saying community driven and open source over here you can see it is a firefox based fully open source automated releases to ensure security community driven constantly improving so it is still in the development phase so build for simplicity so zen browser is designed to be simple and easy to use it's built with the user in mind so you can focus on what matters most vertical tabs they have provided completely customizable over here you can see split views they have provided these features as a split views you can access two web pages on side by side zen is based on the firefox ensuring that your browsing experience prioritizes security and privacy better tab management they provide workspaces fast profile switcher container tabs so tab groups it's in coming soon you can see these features they are working on it if you want to read much more about the security in zen you can access this page and sidebar you can see they have provided a sidebar quick access customizable easy to use then introducing compact mode zen browser's compact mode gives you more screen okay if you want more screen size to view the web pages you can also do that and if you have any questions you can check in the frequently asked questions close this thanks for watching guys do subscribe to my youtube channel rishi labs thank you